hi guys hi guys hi guys hi guys welcome back welcome back it is friday yes it is friday um and uh quick one today i'm actually laughing guys because i was listening to a live by one of my favorite favorite influencers and she was on tiktok and she was just talking about something and you know she's she's very dramatic and if you do not know who i'm talking about i'm talking about blessing ceo the um, relationship um uh, therapist expect uh the most controversial one in africa but uh yeah so she just said something and it quickly just gave me an idea for today's video and um so what are we talking about today <laughs> so she was talking about something that I don't think that everything that we tell you guys it's a lie because it is not so my topic today is who are you dating yes so let's get right into the topic and into the video if you are new here we talk all things faith relationships and family and this is pastor zinke your kingdom baby girl and today yes i am in shorts let me tilt the camera show you guys see i can be a baby girl <laughs> after all i'm just getting ready to go out so guys let's chat let's talk let's let's have a quick um conversation guys so tell me who are you dating guys some of you guys are dating men that cannot do the things that make the pots to cook right so let's let's just clarify that some of us are in relationships and are married to men that actually make the pots to cook <laughs> So guys, as she was saying, and I actually get it, I get it where she was coming from, that a lot of people, when we come here on social media, sometimes you think that what we tell you guys, it's mostly lies, it's made up. But the honest truth is, you need to ask yourself, who am I dating? I, If I come here and I call myself the kingdom baby girl, does it mean that I live in a mansion or what, what? Or... Am I lying? Am I just making it all up? But the honest truth is, you know what? As we are still in February talking about relationships, some of us, the kind of relationship we have with God, it is such a loving, loving, loving relationship between a father and a, a daughter or a father and a son that we are so comfortable to come out here and tell you guys the real relationship that we have with our father and this is what i want to say in as much as you are looking to get into a relationship get into a relationship with someone that you can be proud to talk about someone that you can be proud to show off someone that you can be proud to boast about i boast in the lord i always say it i boast in the lord God has done so much for me. He has done so many wonderful things for me, for my life, in my ministry, in over my family, over my health, over my finances, over my relationships. Of You know what? God has done so many wonderful things. So if we come and we share with you guys, it is not because we are just trying to sell you guys all a lie. Test every spirit yes even the bible does say that test every spirit yes it is not everybody that will come on social media and tell you the honest truth some they will sugarcoat it some they will tell you lies just to string you along but um test test the spirits follow people that are really showing you uh their true selves I am not ashamed to say that I have failed as a pastor. I am not ashamed to say that I have failed. I have I've broken down. I have gotten to a place where I was depressed. I got into a place where I fell into sin. I got into a place where I didn't know whether I was coming or I was going. I got into a place where I didn't even know whether I was called. I didn't even I started doubting my calling, but because of the love of God guys who are you in a relationship with 
I am in a relationship with a father that loves me. He loves me for the person that I am. He loves me as I am. And because I know that I am so loved, it is easy for me to yield myself to him. So guys, if we come here on social media and we share with you some of our stories, believe us, you know, I am not one person to hide my faults from you guys. If I come here sometime, sometimes I will tell you, I was crying last night, you know, sometimes I will come and tell you, I was angry. Sometimes I come here and I tell you guys, the way I'm so stressed, I'm actually going to drink this whole bottle of wine because I am not trying to form, uh, to, to, to form a, a, a brand that is that is untrue i don't want you when you meet me on the streets wearing my shorts like i am today and you start wondering isn't this the same person who calls herself pastor i am a pastor was ordained a pastor i am anointed i preach the word of god but at the same time i also understand that i'm in a relationship with a man who wants to see me look like a baby girl so guys believe when we tell you who we are but you need to test the spirit i love you guys until next week ah this was such a random video and all over the place but until next week guys i am looking forward to having you join the family join the tribe join the tribe what are you still waiting for where we talk all things faith relationships and family next week we are continuing talking about relationships and yeah i want to know what you guys are expecting for valentine's day what are you getting some of us are expecting cars some of us are expecting houses some of us are only expecting chocolates some of us are expecting um a bouquet of flowers some of us are expecting some money because hey this baby girl lifestyle no be easy or love you guys until next time bye bye